Are you ready to be great? Stop letting self-doubt, insecurity, and fear prevent you from building your business. This morning, wake up to success. Here's John Preston. Good morning. Thanks for joining us here on Wake Up to Success. Today, I want to talk about small tasks that have nothing whatsoever to do with your business that have a tremendous impact on your ability to be successful. They're the little things that we know we need to do, but we just don't get around to do them, and they just become a nuisance. You know, on a previous episode, I talked about the Navy Admiral, who remembers his first years as a Navy SEAL, when the first thing they showed him how to do was to make his bed. And as a 19-year-old ready to fight, he had no idea why they wanted him to know how to make his bed. But what he later realized is that starting the day with a completed task, something you accomplished first thing in the morning, set the tone for the entire day. Now, the opposite can be true as well. If there's something that you know needs doing in your life, in your personal life, around the house, in the office, or whatever, and you just can't get around to doing it, it can leave you feeling bad about yourself. It can leave you feeling like you fail that task and drain your energy from doing more important things. Now, I was talking with a friend of mine earlier, and he was talking about the fact that every month he's paying $25 for an extra phone line that he no longer needs. And he has on his calendar every day, cancel phone line. And every day he just doesn't want to deal with customer service, so he kicks the can down the road. And so day after day, he starts his day off with a defeat, a chore he simply doesn't want to embrace. And as a result, it can often set the tone for the entire day. Now, hopefully most days he offsets that with wins, but it's still there. Another friend of mine went to a conference once and he heard a speaker talk about, you know, going to the roar, how lions will use the roar of the male lion to drive prey towards the female. And if you just go towards the roar, you've got a better chance of survival. And he was so touched by that, he bought a painting of this giant majestic lion roaring as a reminder of him to that lesson. And he brought it to his office and the painting set in the floor. He needed to have it framed and hung. So every day when he walked in the office, the first thing he saw was a painting that he bought that he never got around to hanging. So it was a sense of defeat, a sense of failure. Me personally, months ago, I bought paint to paint a bathroom. And every time I walk into that bathroom in my house, I'm reminded that it's still not painted. Those things can sap our energy. They can sap our ability to focus on the more important things because we just beat ourselves up over tasks we don't accomplish. It happens all the time. Now, I don't know a lot about feng shui, but years ago, a designer friend of mine tried to explain it to me, and now I've forgotten most of what she said, but one thing stuck with me. One of the core features of feng shui is that you do not have sharp corners on any of your furniture. Now, why is that? Because that sharp corner can cause pain if you bump into it. So the theory is that a small part of your bandwidth, a small part of your mental energy is always focusing on avoiding that sharp corner. Even if you don't think about it, it's there. And so that's a portion of your energy that is being spent on something that doesn't have to be there. That same thing applies to these small tasks that we put off doing. That kit, that bathroom that's not getting painted that painting that's not getting hung, and that phone line that's not getting canceled. If we accomplish those things, if we hang that picture, if we cancel that phone line, if we paint that bathroom, they have nothing to do with our business. But the extra energy boost that accomplishing those little tasks provides us could be just what we need to take on the bigger tasks that will take our business to the place we want it to be and get us to the success that we want. 
So if you've got that little task that you just keep putting off and putting off and putting off, do it. And you'll be surprised what a boost of energy that will provide you to accomplish the more important things you need to achieve.